Hi, this is Rebecca from PTC, and today I'm going to be showing you how to return multiple results when programming in PTC MathCAD. First, we'll define a function f of x, y, and set it equal to a program structure which includes three equations. If we were to define x is 2 and y is 4 and solve, you can see it returns one value, 6. This corresponds to the last equation in the program structure. If we wanted all three of the equations to be solved and shown, all you have to do is add a matrix at the bottom of the structure. This can be a 3 by 1 or a 1 by 3. We'll define three new variables, a, b, and c, and insert the local assignment. Now, as you can see, all three values have been solved for. Next, we'll go through an engineering example. Given different power values, provide the maximum and minimum allowable power using different tolerances. If the value of power is greater than 200 watts, then the tolerance should be 5%. Otherwise, a tolerance of 10% should be used. We will define the function as power band of power and set it equal to a program structure including an if-else statement. Again, to return both the maximum and minimum values, we want to include a matrix at the bottom of the program structure. We will press return and insert a matrix. We will select Pmax and Pmin as our two variables. In this case, we will set these values to both sections of the if-else statement to solve depending on the power value. Now if we call our power band variable with a value of 300 watts, we get the maximum and minimum. And if we call the power band va variable with a value of 20 watts, it will solve based on this else section. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.